felt like we are doing a lot here for the community with uh, with New Hope Seattle, and for you know for somebody to come around and do that to us, it just felt like a slap in the face. Shoreline police arrested Tony Lee for allegedly spray painting KD and Kid on the youth bus. Rather ironic, considering he's 35 years old. We uh, originally bought that church for or bought the bus for for church purposes, and and haven't been able to use it as much as we expected to, and. Um, for it, for it to be vandalized like that was uh, was hurtful for us. Investigators say Lee has been on a vandalism spree for three years, repeatedly tagging Kay and Kid on homes, city property, and businesses, including the auto parts store where they say they nearly caught him in the act. Police caught up with Lee and arrested him here at Action Auto Parts. They say that they found light blue paint on his vest, gloves, and jacket, the same color they say used to write K on the building. Oh, I'm happy as can be. It's wonderful. I, I, my hat's off to the Shoreline Police Department. Owner Joe McIntosh says Lee left more than $750 in damage, just a small part of the $7,000 in damage caused by the spree. Prosecutors are charging him with felony malicious mischief. I hope they make an example of him, because he's not the only one in our community doing this. In Shoreline, I'm Shamari Stone, Como, 4 News.